Hi there, Tenzi here. So today I will be using this yarn. I got it from Ollie's um, and for those who don't know, Ollie's is a discount warehouse. So I bought them for the price of $1.99 and that's in March 2023. So I got this one. Uh, it's um, it's a super fine weight one. It says it uses um, crochet hook 2.25 millimeters and a needle which is also the same 2.25. And it's a 100% acrylic yarn. It's 100 grams, 239 yards or 219 meters. And it is amigurumi that makes two little amigurumi animals here and the pattern is actually on yarnspirations.com so here it is uh, so i got two of these are the only three left actually so i got two that i can make llama out of them and i think this was um a unicorn this makes unicorns yeah this makes llamas so i thought those colors are very very cute and they they go well together and i really like them so let's see what else is here machine wash and dry of course it's acrylic no ironing and no bleach and those colors are pretty pretty vibrant i i like them they're very cute and look at these llamas look at these faces so here you cannot see the unicorns very well just the tail but i checked online and they look like the like quick crochet projects here no it doesn't work so let's start my project that i'll use those for So let's start. I'll be making a little owl sitting uh, on a branch and it's gonna be a keychain. So it is very, very easy and a very quick project. You can use any yarn and any color pup uh, finger puppet eyes. So that's how they're used and we'll make an owl or maybe you can make other toys so i thought i will be the, the the one that makes sense the most since it has large eyes but a lot of animals have large large eyes all right so tie your yarn and make make a loop all right so chain two because we'll be making double crochets. Pull them on the side. slip knot in the chain there now we're gonna start increasing we'll, we'll do double crochet here and then in each stitch we're gonna put two double crochets so we can increase in a same rate so here next so we had two of 15 stitches we're gonna end up with 30 <music> Okay, so into the chain we will be doing 
half double crochets. Till you cover the whole chain. slip stitch into that first stitch and you can chain one to make it stronger and you can cut off your yarn here and let's make into a magic ring we'll make three chain chain three and Two more double crochets. Okay, and then we'll pull through them, and then we'll make a little flower from the pink one. So let's make a little flower in a crochet in a magic ring we will chain three yarn over and make two double crochets and chain two again do a slip stitch into the magic ring Do a slip stitch here, then we'll chain two, two, then we'll do two more double crochets, we will chain two again, slip stitch into the magic ring, yeah, We'll chain two, two double crochets, chain two, slip stitch into the magic ring, and we have a little flower here. You can use hot glue, glue gun to glue them or you can just sew them together. Pull your magic ring really hard, tight, so you can close the, the ring in the middle. Once you're ready with the flower, grab a little bit of white yarn and we'll use that one to attach the flower and make the middle of it. So we'll use all the colors and that little puck. It looks like a puck to me, like a hockey puck. All right, so I'll make a little French knot here. Right, I'll make two. Right, so here I'll go back down through the center and there. I have a little nice white center which I'll use to connect and I'll, I'll use the spot where I ended to put my flower there so I can hide that little um, 
well it's not really symmetric here it does not look that pretty so I'll use that flower to hide my spot and it's time to put my keychain Smash that like button.